Hi there, this is Robert Dorsey here. Um, I got to do a short video here on something that uh, come come up with me for a couple of times now, and especially now that I have gotten a new computer, uh, one thing that happened with me is that I've opened up my Google Calendar, and of course I've also synced this with my phone. So uh, one of the biggest reasons I want to get rid of all these entries in here on this calendar, these are just all birthdays. Uh, birthdays from people that are in Google, my contact list, I'm not sure where that pulls it all, I think Google Plus uh, contacts probably. And I want to get rid of all those because I'm, I'm, I'm not interested in that. So what I did, and of course you can do the same thing here, it says I went to Google Calendar Remove birthdays, how to remove birthdays uh, in uh, Google search. And of course I clicked on the first one that come around and just to put a plug in here for these uh, techie people, Awesomely Techie um, has put up this website here and <clears throat> their instructions work here. But one thing I want to tell you and notice it, it says click on, uh, once we go to the pinwheel on the Google Plus, which is this little gear up here, right? And we want to go to settings. But before I get there, I'm going to read this to you. It says, um, and then click on the cal calendars tab and notice how the birthday is grayed out. Google wants to make this very difficult for us. You see, that's what happened to me the last time I did this. But I've gone through this here now and I'm just going to show you on my version. Uh, when I go to settings and then go to calendars, okay, now, in uh, my Google search on the website, it says that the Google uh, Square is grayed out. Mine is not. Um, I have a checkbox here that I can uncheck. Now that should take out the birthdays. So if I go back to calendar, there you see now, the birthdays are gone. Okay. Um, but I see um, there's some other things here. Holidays. Um, I don't need to have all these holidays in here. They're probably holidays that more than, than I need, right? So I'm going to go back to calendars again. And if I go down to the bottom here, it says holidays uh, and observances. And observances. You see, there's a whole bunch of stuff there, not just holidays. Okay, so uncheck that box. These other ones here uh, for notifications and for tasks, they're grayed out so that they will always be um, active okay so if I go back to calendar now there look at that isn't that clean <laughs> and, and uh, yeah and there's a, I got a webinar coming up tomorrow and so that's what I wanted to do I don't need all that other stuff cluttering up the um, you know cluttering up the calendar and especially when I have it synced to my to my phone to my, I have it, oops, dropped it. I have it synced to my phone and all that stuff was cluttering up my, my phone. I had to get rid of it. <laughs> okay. Okay. That's how I got rid of all the birthday notifications in my Google Calendar. Have a good day. I will see you on another video. Hope that helps. Uh, if that helps at all, please uh, uh, comment and share and I will see you on another video. Bye for now.